Welcome to BNC Car Reviews Channel. 2023 Honda CRV Hybrid vs. Toyota RAV4 Hybrid Comparison Test Practical Considerations. Few things bring people together today like our collective hatred of high gasoline prices. Regardless of who you blame for it, prices are high right now and are coming down quickly. It's enough to drive some folks into an electric car, but for those not yet ready to make the leap, the humble hybrid gets another turn in the spotlight. This time, though, we're not only talking about egg-shaped cars like the Prius and others. Instead, we're looking at heart-of-the-market vehicles like the 2023 Honda CR-V Hybrid and the 2023 Toyota RAV4 Hybrid. Participation Trophies Here at Motor Trend, we don't do ties. We put our noses to the grindstone until one vehicle wins our latest comparison test. Sometimes this makes our lives a lot harder, this is one of those times. Both the 2023 Honda CR-V Hybrid and 2023 Toyota RAV4 Hybrid are excellent buys, and you'll be happy with either one. They have far more in common than they have differences, and in the end, our decision came down to critical numbers, price and fuel economy. Only one could win, though, so follow along to see how we got there. Different styles, same results. Be it how they look or how they drive, the 2023 Honda CR-V Hybrid and 2023 Toyota RAV4 Hybrid have different styles and different swagger, but the end result is effectively the same. Indeed, they may have been developed by different companies, but they're two sides of the same coin. When we look at these compact SUVs, we see distinct personalities doing the same job. To our eye, the Honda's design language inside and out is a bit more sophisticated and premium, and it drives that way, too. The Toyota looks a bit more rugged and adventure-ready, and that's how it drives. Neither is prettier or better driving than the other. From the driver's seat, the 2023 Honda CR-V Hybrid is a bit quieter inside than the 2023 Toyota RAV4 Hybrid, but both are excellent. The Honda handles slightly better, but each is pleasantly sporty for a workaday family SUV. The Honda's drivetrain is quieter than the Toyota's under hard acceleration, but they're both equally smooth and refined. Each likewise has good brake pedal feel that completely masks the transition between regenerative braking and mechanical braking. We do appreciate the Honda's B-Drive mode, which amps up the regenerative braking and comes in handy when going down hills. Offsetting Technical Advantages Unsurprisingly for direct competitors, the Honda CR-V and Toyota RAV4 hybrids offer most of the same tech features. Each, though, has at least one distinct feature, and each does something better than the other. Both, for example, have adaptive cruise control and lane-keeping systems. Honda's is the more sophisticated package, able to hold the vehicle centered in the lane, whereas Toyota's only prevents the SUV from drifting over the lines. Law requires backup cameras these days, but they aren't all created equal. Honda has a simple rear-view camera for reversing, and it works well enough. Toyota, meanwhile, offers a 360-degree view by stitching four camera images together, making the vehicle itself invisible on the screen. If you run over something while the Toyota's cameras are on, it's because you aren't paying attention. Each SUV also carries its maker's latest infotainment software, and it's another case of give and take. Toyota's new system looks far more contemporary and is pretty straightforward to use. Honda's offers a lot more customization, but the learning curve is steeper and the look isn't as up to the minute. The CR-V and RAV4 both also come with power tailgates at this price point, but where the Honda requires you reach for a specific button to close it, the Toyota requires only a gentle tug anywhere on the gate to bring it down. It's a minor convenience, but one we'd like to see on more vehicles.